What is up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you how to edit like Brandon Wolfel. So this should be pretty good. Alright guys, so I just hopped on my computer and I'm on his Instagram right now and this is his style. There's a lot of teals and pinks, which is pretty nice. So yeah, I'll show you how to recreate that and get a nice look for your photos. All right guys, so now we're on Lightroom and this is the photo I choose to do it for. So first thing you're gonna wanna do is make sure that the um, white balance, you make it so the blues really pop out and there's kind of less pinks. It depends on the picture, but um, yeah. So we're gonna put up the contrast because that's how his looks bring up the highlights make sure we get those nice pinks bring up the shadows so we can start to see the face which is my face haha uh -huh. bring up the whites about right there and then bring the blacks down to right about there and that's really nice exposure for the um, picture so for um, his, he has some clarity, I see. So let's bring the clarity up to about 29. That looks about right. Yeah, very clean, very clean picture. Let's bring the um, vibrance down to about negative 19. Bring the saturation up about seven. That looks right. That's pretty much how his are exposed for mo for the most part. So let's hop into the tone curve. This is where you wanna crush the blacks, make it pretty prominent, about like that. And then we're gonna make an S curve. Uh, I don't know if we'll, we'll just barely bring the highlights down. So right about there, that looks pretty clean. You get nice, um, nice blacks right here. here. Let me bring this down a bit. Right there. Yeah, that's looking better. So here's how he gets his teal colors. Goes into here. Or actually, is this? No, this is probably blue. Then he moves this over to about, I'd say negative 60. Make it about right there. And that's the type of blue he has in his pictures. Um, let's see. Let's make the purples a little um, desaturated. And here's how he gets the pinks. He makes his reds about there, about negative 80, I'd say, around that. Drop the saturation a little bit. That's looking pretty fire, if I do say so myself. Let's see. Yeah, the pinks. Make sure that's like that. Bring up the face color. That's looking pretty good. Oranges. Is there any orange? Okay. So, hmm, what should we do with those oranges? Probably make them pink. I might drop the saturation of those a little bit because it's mostly pink and teal. So we, oh, okay, here's split toning. So we'll bring this up a bit, make it kind of warmer tones, kind of reddish. That looks about right. And then the shadows, probably about a tealish. A tealish color looks about right. Um, how far should we go? Let me bring this up so I can see. About right there, 193. Let's balance this out to about right there. That looks pretty good. Actually, you know what? Probably bring this down so the blacks are um, still kind of blackish and not too teal. And for the detail, I usually bring it about around 60, 55. Um, for the radius, I'll bring it about 1.5. Detail, 30. Masking, 25. 
Then for the noise reduction, I'll probably make it just around 20 and bring this to 30. And that's all I would do for the detail. Now for lens corrections, we don't need none of that, none of that, none of that. Actually, I might want to saturate this a little more just to make it look a bit better. See, that looks really good right there. Yeah, right there. Perfect. So that's how you get the Brandon Wolfel look on your um, photos in Lightroom. So if you guys did enjoy, please leave a like and subscribe. I have a lot more Lightroom tutorials and I'll be making more soon. So I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.